There is one role in the game that I especially like to use when a striker is really short, but he's extremely fast. And that's the advance forward. But there's a little trick I like to apply to that role to make sure that he's always trying to break the offside trap. And that is to ask him to dribble more and take more risks. Then this guy is roaming. It's a complete forward. Yeah, and we've got advance forward. Who is trying to break offside traps every single day is alive. <laughs> that's all. And... We've got this combination, intentional combination of pass into space, ball ball into box and right defense. It's an intentional combination. Okay, so every Y is set to um, angles, right? Oh, you sweet thing, you. That's what I meant by looking to break the offside trap all day long. I just explained it. That's what happens. Okay, look at this, right? That PI is intentional for this role because every chance I want him to break that line. Because he's fast. He doesn't have height. This guy is the shortest bum on the pitch. Look at him. You can even tell from this. Look at him. Everyone is taller than him. Right. So, as they play this, he already starts his run. There we go. Boom. Any chance he gets, he's going to try and break the offside trap. So, what kind of setups can you use the super advanced forward for? Um, you can use them in a lot of mid-block systems, a lot of counter-attacking systems, any system that is attacking space. Ideally, you want to be attacking space um, because you're going to have this really short play <laughs> running behind defensive lines. He's not going to be very great in the air, so he needs balls played into space, which is the reason why I'm using that combination of pass into space and right defense. And if you play with work ball into box, you can, uh, it's, uh, it's a style of play where you don't really drop a lot of crosses so the ball is moved around a bit more and I combine that with whole shape because then it's not looking for a counter all the time because sometimes when you're looking at counters, you get a lot of crosses as well. So I'm trying to keep the um, control of the game so that we play more of these kind of balls over the top of defenses or through defensive lines. So the next time you want to use these instructions in combination, you can apply it to mid-blocks, defensive systems, a 4-4-2, two strikers, a single striker. As long as he's attacking space, you're using him as an advance forward, it can work. Well, these nippy strikers, they used to work in 21, 22, 23. I just never did a video on it. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you found it useful, if you have any more questions, you guys know where to find me. Meanwhile, stay safe, take care of yourselves. I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.